Welcome back. You're watching SABC News Primetime. President Jacob Zuma has warned South Africans against taking the country backwards by constantly destroying property and infrastructure that's meant for the betterment of people's lives. He was speaking at Kovimbaba in the Eastern Cape, where he launched the multi-million rand Ngora water treatment works. The facility is set to bring much-needed water supply to rural communities. A presidential touchdown in this remote community, followed by an inspection at the newly launched water treatment works. It draws water from Noha Dam, purifies it, and then pumps it to no less than 200 villages across three local municipalities in this largely rural district. President Zuma couldn't overemphasize the need for communities to refrain from destroying infrastructure. Something has to be done. We are becoming we are becoming a bad example immediately after everyone in the world has been saying these Mandela people understand and they know what democracy is all about. Democracy does not mean you promote anarchy. A message well received by the community. For this village, however, unclean drinking water remains a reality. People from town are shocked that we drink such water, but it's by the grace of God that we are not sick. This project is funded by the Water and Sanitation Department to the tune of 64 million rand. The launch of this water project today by President Jacob Zuma has given hope to households like this one that their days of drinking water with the animals will soon be behind them and their dream of having clean and safe drinking water will soon be realized. For SIPC News, I am Unati Pinose at Ngoha in Kofimvapa.